Welcome friends, this video is part of uh, Ethics, Integrity and Aptitude series. This video is an in introductory video. In this video, let's learn about uh, some of the important words that are used in ethics very frequently. This include ethics, morality, values and beliefs. First, let's look at what is ethics. So ethics is a systematic study of human actions. It's a study of human actions from the point of view of their rightfulness or wrongfulness as means for attainment of the ultimate happiness. So ethics is a systematic study. So ethics is a branch of philosophy. It is a branch of philosophy called moral philosophy. So it is a systematic study of human actions from the point of view of their rightfulness or wrongfulness for the attainment of ultimate happiness of the society. So ethics are the norms, these are the standards, these are the rules and code of conduct which are placed by the society, profession or an organization and an individual to, uh, to follow rightful uh, way for ultimate happiness of the society as a whole. So this is ethics. So ethics uh, simply can be defined as moral principles that govern a person's behavior or the conducting of an activity. So as I mentioned earlier, ethics is a norm. It is a standard. It is a norm, standard or code of conduct that is placed by the society, organization or a profession and an individual to follow certain rules and regulation while performing their duties. So the, the word ethics derived from the Greek word ethikos, okay, which itself derived its, uh, its origin from the word ethos meaning custom or character. So ethics means custom or character. Let's look at what is morality. So we know that ethics and morality are used interchangeably. Even though the core value of ethics and morality are the same, that means uh, the guiding an individual uh, towards right conduct, but there is slight difference between ethics and morality. So whereas morality, the definition of morality is that the principles concerning the distinction between right and wrong are good and bad behavior. So on the one side, the ethics deals with the code of conduct, uh, rules and regulation, and norms of an individual from a societal perspective. So society puts obligation on individual to follow a certain path. That is the ethics. Whereas morality is deeper than that. It moves deeper into the individual level as well as spiritual level. So morality acts at an individual level. So the morality of an individual may differ uh, from that of other individuals. So it is individualistic in nature, whereas ethics is societal in nature. It, it deals with the society organization. So I hope uh, you clear the doubts between morality and ethics. So the morality uh, derived its meaning from Latin word that means moralitas, that means manner, character, proper behavior. So this is about ethics and morality. Now let's look at the values. So values are also used frequently in this course. Of ethics so values are the things that are most important for a particular person or individual so values are the things which are valued by some someone so for a soldier patriotism is an important value okay for doctor professionalism or serving the lives is an important value for Gandhiji non-violence non is an important value Gandhiji and his followers okay uh, these are all the values so values may differ from individual to individual from one organization to another organization so values may be individualistic values or organization value so we know that value can be divided into two important broad categories these include intrinsic value and extrinsic value Intri intrinsic value are an end in itself these are all the goals these are the final destination itself this include truth beauty goodness, temperance, courage, these are not means to an end, these are end in itself, okay? And extrinsic values like wealth, physical fitness, some, some cases beauty, okay? Uh, earning money, uh, love for money, these are extrinsic value. These are means to achieve a certain end. For example, wealth may be a means to achieve a happy life, that is an intrinsic value, okay? So, but we cannot uh, divide the values into uh, rigid intrinsic and extrinsic classification. For some person, uh, uh, securing uh, the wealth may be an intrinsic value. For other, it may be a means to an end. Okay, the wealth may be distributed uh, for the attainment for the benefit of the poor. So, for, for some person, so 
it, it can be individualistic. So values may be positive value or negative value, permanent or transient value, uh, but values for sure uh, decides and influences the behavior of a person more, more significantly. So values uh, influence the behavior of a person in a major way. So now let's look at the beliefs. So beliefs also uh, influences the behavior of a person. So beliefs are the internal feelings that something is true, even though that belief may be shallow, unproven or irrational. So you may believe that uh, uh, all Chinese are selfish or against India's interest. So your belief is something that you hold that as true, okay, even though that belief may be shallow or unproven. So we cannot prove that all Chinese are selfish, all Chinese are against India's interest, okay. So sometimes it may be irrational. So some people uh, believe that uh, Hitler may be a great leader. So that is irrational or unproven. Okay, it is proven that Hitler is the great dictator, but he is not a good human being. He is not a great leader. Okay, so it depends uh, from one person to another person. Belief sometimes may go wrong. Okay, it may be unproven. So belief can be divided into core beliefs and disposition beliefs. Now, core beliefs acts always uh, within the uh, thinking thought process of the individual whereas disposition beliefs are influenced by the society okay so your parents your teacher and your society uh, from childhood influences your beliefs okay uh, you may take something from your society and you are influenced by the society these beliefs are called dispositions dispositional beliefs so this is it about the important terms which are used in the ethics so this is the first video uh, if you want me to make more videos like this uh, please comment in the section below and please share uh, these videos so that more people can benefit uh, from this thank you thanks for watching please like share and subscribe thanks